Here we are, August 9th. Pretty mm -hmm. certain there will be an Apple event sometime in the next 30 days. Mm -hmm. Pretty certain there will be a new iPhone or two announced. Um, and the rumor mill is going hot and heavy. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I mean, we're seeing we're seeing more people who purportedly have actual hardware, and that's and more people who are willing to actually share photos of what they purport to be actual hardware. And yes, thirty days before what we expect to be an event is the time where we start to start to take that stuff a little bit more seriously because this is the time where they're they, they they've got enough they've got things ramped up and they got so many people briefed in that there is no un, no godly way that you can keep a lid on on what's going on so we They're can kind millions of, of them we can kind yeah. of uh uh trust or relatively i mean they, you know even with the samsung uh, note 7 when they announced it last week there were a there were at least two items where the rumor mill got it completely wrong so it is still possible yeah one well, or I mean, two the rumor items will can tell you what is going into various stages of the product, can tell you exactly like, which feature it might be in which model. But all, the most importantly, it can't tell you the story. So what the Apple has never really been about the chipsets. It's about the feature sets. And so it's got these two lenses. And it sounds like one of those lenses is a black and white one to increase low sensitivity. But what is that really going to deliver with the right. camera? And how are they going to tell us about it? What are the results? How is the, the chip, the processor? We know they're making an Apple A10, but what, what's in the guts of that chip? And how is that going to process and work with those lenses? And that's what Phil Schiller is going to tell us on this stage so if we know the bits like there the rumor today was that it was going to have a 1080p screen on the uh iphone 7 and a 2k screen on the iphone 7 plus which is a big bump in resolution for both devices and a not and an actual standard not a weird apple 3x size or something mm -hmm. but you know what is that what are they going to come out to say sharpest display ever are they going to say well it works with google cardboard now now Probably finally as good as the galaxy s7 things like that yeah